stay or will he go? That is the question that everybody will be asking as he enters this offseason. He poured fuel on the fire yesterday with that tweet of his silhouette walking in the tunnel. Max? Yep. Just a photo. No message. What does this tweet say about Tom Brady? Let me be very clear about this. Okay. I don't have a problem with this tweet. I don't have a problem with it. But a lot of you should. <laughs> Let me explain. Tom Brady is the GOAT. He's the greatest football player who ever lived. At that position to lead the way he has, perform the way he has, under pressure, he became greater and greater as his career went on, like better at his craft, into an absurdly late age. It's unimpeachable. But I recall when Alex Rodriguez, who was also among the all-time greats in baseball, opted out of his deal during the World Series. And by the way, there was nothing ambiguous about it. He opted out. He wanted a new contract. Everyone killed him. The media killed him. Fans killed him. He's upstaging the World Series. I didn't have a problem with it. Whatever. You know, you can pay attention to it or not. What, are you going to forget about the World Series? But if you had a problem with that, you better have a problem with this. Why would Tom Brady get a pass on this? He sends out a, 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 a begging for attention kind of oh. tweet. That's what that is. Why wouldn't you just say, why do you have you walking out? Which way are his feet pointed? Is he going in or is he going out? Is he wearing street clothes? What does this say? That tweet is designed to get everyone talking about you going into the Friday before the Super Bowl. So what's that? Why does he get a pass for that? Again, I don't care. He's entitled to do what he wants. I didn't care when A-Rod opted out of his deal. But if you cared about A-Rod doing that and other athletes upstaging the super, the, the, the event, making it about them, how is this any different? It's the exact same thing. And just because he's the GOAT does not mean he's perfect and above criticism, period. You know. And by the way, he's saying he's out of New England. That's what Miami's that says. Miami's approving of this message? Well. Of Max Kellerman? Wow, okay. Max, here's where I would agree with you. Tom Brady has always said and done the right thing, the Patriot way. He's always done that. He's always going to make sure he puts the team first. I agree with this point. This is about Tom Brady putting himself first. Yes, did he want a little attention? Absolutely. We all want attention every now and then. So Tom Brady's getting his attention. I'll disagree with you. I think he's going back to New England. I think when it's all said and done, Tom Brady understands the value of loyalty. He understands the value of the family atmosphere between he and Robert Kraft. And I think he wants to be able to do it as he's always done it by recreating a team. Everyone says, why would he go back to New England? There are no weapons there. Tom Brady has always made every weapon that he's ever had better because they were around him, not because that they needed to make him better. He still has good years left, and everyone is wanting That's to That's not him. entirely true what you just said. Randy Moss made Tom Brady better than vice versa. Tom Brady set records when Randy Moss... They didn't win Tom Brady, is great. Tom Brady was yeah. great before Randy Moss. Sure. He was so was greater. Randy Moss. He was greater with Randy Moss, right. and he's been great without Randy Moss. He has always been... But great. Randy Moss had better seasons before he saw Tom Brady, and Tom Brady had his best season when Randy Moss was there. Randy Moss has been great for years, so has Tom Brady. They made each other better. That's the one situation. Sure. I'll give you that. Tom Brady understands this one thing about his career because he's seen it. Joe Montana even gave him the advice. The grass is not always greener on the other side, Tommy. He went to Kansas City, but we still know and revere Joe Montana for the 49er years. So if you're Tom Brady, here's what I would tell you. A little piece of advice, and Joe Montana gave him the same advice. Stay in New England. Finish the storybook career there. The tweet... I don't pay any attention to it. It's about Tom Brady doing what we all want to do at some point. You know what? I'm, gonna, I'm not going to conform to the Patriot way. I'm not going to conform to doing the right thing. Yes, it's the Friday before the Super Bowl. So I'm going to get a little attention and take all the attention Here's off the of Max problem, Kellerman Here's and the first take. Here's the problem with what Brady did. Number one, the Patriot way suited him fine until it didn't. Then he did an end around Belichick, went to the owner, and got Garoppolo shipped out of town, right? So the Patriot way, Brady gave into it, the whole thing, until the Patriot way came looking for him. Hey, old man, get out. We got a young guy. Then he undermined the Patriot way. That's number one. Number two, he wants to get paid. Mm -hmm. Belichick's not going to pay him. So if he does another end around to Kraft and now Belichick, the GM's got to devote these resources he doesn't want to to Brady, 
Now what's Kraft going to do? Also tell him who to put around Brady with his hamstrung because he's handcuffed because he spent the money? Whose team is it? Belichick's team. Whose team is it? Bill Belichick. Don't ever get team. it twisted. It's Robert Kraft's team, okay? Don't uh -oh. ever, don't ever well, get it twisted. Well, okay, man. fine. One last don't, thing don't about Montana. That's you can't right. It's tell Kraft. by it's the Kraft. Jimmy Garoppolo right. right. situation That's how right. it played out. One last thing about Montana. Joe Montana. Is it Walsh or is it Montana? Of course, it was always more Walsh than Montana. Just like it's more Belichick than Brady. It's a coach's league, but they're the goats. It's a coach's league. Yeah, it is. But they're the goats. Oh my goodness. Yeah. They're, Are you they're, serious? Oh yeah, yeah. NBA is a players' league. Baseball's a GM's league. NFL's a coach's league. But let's not get bogged down. Completely disagree. They're the goats. Joe Montana went to KC year one, took him to the AFC championship game. And guess what? The dynasty in San Francisco continued because they had Steve Young. Montana didn't get Steve Young shipped out. This Another Hall of Famer. Get, this is yeah, just oh, getting okay. good. And we but, gotta get but Jimmy G's in the Super Bowl this year, but not for the Patriots. Let's Patriots not, ain't in the Super Bowl. Let's not compare Jimmy G to Steve Young. Let, let, let's not do that, okay? Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.